The Flat Nation YouTube game, what it do, man? This your boy Duffy. You already know the vibes, man. We're back with another daily video. But look, y'all, as usual, man, before we hop in the video today, go ahead and start off by dropping a like on the video, man. If you know, if you, oh, I said that wrong. If you don't know, dropping a like on the video. Helps push the video to recommend it, which allows more people to see the video. You know it helps build the LaFleur Nation up, helps build the family. So, hey, make sure y'all drop a like on the video. Let's go ahead and aim for 30 likes on this video. And if you're new to the channel, y'all, listen, 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 listen. If y'all new to the channel, do not forget to hit that subscribe button for your boy, man. I've been posting every single day for five months straight. Every single morning, 10 a.m. Central Time, 11 a.m. Eastern Time. So, hey, go ahead and help your boy out, man. Hit that subscribe button. And um, make sure y'all turn on y'all post notifications too, y'all, so you do not miss the daily bangers. And um, make sure y'all follow my Twitch. It's down below. Well, it's not down below, but it's the same as all my other socials, man. Duffy LaFleur, who just hit 1.2K over there on the Twitchy. And the Twitch be fire, bro. The streams be going crazy, man. Shout out to the gang over there on Twitch, man. But um, I ain't gonna waste too much more of y'all's time. Let's go ahead and jump straight into this video. Yeah, if you're hearing this man, you got car lacking, man. Make sure you hit that like button and make sure you hit that subscribe button. All right, y'all. As y'all can see, man, from the thumbnail in the title today, man, I got the number three overall draft pick, Lamelo Ball build for y'all on next gen NBA 2K21, bro. This build goes crazy, bro. I ain't gonna lie, it does everything. Literally everything that Lamelo Ball does, IRL, bro, is what he does right here on the game, bro. I ain't gonna lie. Listen, it's a true demigod build. You will not regret making this build. It does everything, bro. But look, I know LaMelo Ball is a point guard, bro. I know this, I know this, I know this. But for the sake of the game, go to the power forward position because I'm going to be creating a demigod build with y'all today, man. This build goes crazy, bro. And I'm telling you, it does everything that LaMelo does, bro. Whatever him, you know, gotta rock the one piece, man. Let's go ahead and jump into this, man. Six, seven, like my boy LaMelo. We're going to drop the weight all the way down. For the wingspan, you want to go to 6'11", y'all. 6'11". Body shape, you know we're rocking with the slight. Like my boy Melo, man. You know he's skinny, bro. Hopefully he beef up when he get in the league. You feel me? <laughs> All right, now right here for these attribute upgrades, man. Make sure you copy exactly what I put here for these attribute upgrades, man. So you get the best version of the LaMelo ball build. All right, starting out with close shot, man. You want to bring it up to 850. Your driving layup, you want to go ahead and max it out at 94. And your driving dunk, max it out at 94. And then bring your standing all the way up to 71. And that'll leave you with 13 finishing badges, y'all. For shooting, you want to go ahead and max your mid-range shot and your three ball. And then you want to go ahead and bring your free throws up to 851. And that'll leave you with 20 of them shooting things, man. For playmaking, you want to bring your pass accuracy to 870. Max your ball handle and your speed with ball. And that's going to leave you with 20 playmaking badges. For defense, we're going to max the interior up to a 62. Make the perimeter defense. Go to max it out in a 95. Max your block out. Max your offensive rebound out. Max your defensive rebound out. And that's going to leave you with 20 of them red things, man. 20 of them. Hey, stop the show badges, man. I ain't going to lie. These badges. <laughs> this build is too overpowered, y'all. It's too overpowered. All right, for the speed, man, you want to go ahead and max the speed out. Max your acceleration out. And then we can go ahead and um, max our vertical out at 95. So if I'm doing this right, bro, if I'm thinking right. Oh, and take take your strength down one and bring it to your um, vertical. My fault, y'all. Make sure you have that 70 vertical because you need 70 vertical to unlock every single contact dunk in the game, bro. So make sure you put your vertical to 70, bro. That is key, bro. That is key. So, we got 13 finishing, 20 shooting, 20 playmaking, and 20 defensive, y'all. That is over 70 badges, I believe, bro. 70, 73, I believe, bro. Yeah, 73, 20, 40, 60. Yeah, 73, 73. That was right. Quick math off the top of the head, man. So, not the W's for the quick math in the comment section, y'all. <laughs> but look, and when we look at this build from 99, y'all, this is where it gets crazy, bro. This is where it goes crazy. Not, look at 99 man our driving layup will be a yeah i'm tripping y'all i'm tripping i'm tripping 
Yeah, I'm driving. I'm, yeah, yeah, we're gonna live. We're gonna live. Driving live is gonna be a 98. Our dunk's gonna be a 98. Our standing dunk's gonna be a 75. You know, I just put that in there. Our mid range shot is a 99. Our three ball is going to be a 94. Our ball control is gonna be an 88. Our speed ball is gonna be 88. Trust me, bro. Trust me. All right, I'm gonna get in there in a second. I'm gonna get in there in a second. Our interior defense is gonna be a 66. We will be playing a guard with this build. We're gonna be running the one with this build. So that's a pretty good interior defense for a guard because you know guards would have none at all. Um, our perimeter defense is gonna jump up to a 99. Our blocks are gonna be an 88. Our um, offensive rebound is gonna be an 86. Our defense rebound is gonna be a 95. So we will be snagging with this build, y'all. Our speed is jumping up to a um, 89. Our acceleration is jumping up to an 85. And our stamina will be a 99. Now, for all the little attributes that I didn't go over, or I, yeah, that I didn't go over, just add plus four to all those attributes and you'll know this true build at 99. But look, some of y'all are probably wondering about why the speed is kind of low. I don't know if I want to make that, but trust me, bro. When you get this badge right over there on the playmaking side, right under Diamond, the little foot running, the quick first step on Hall of Fame, bro, I'm telling you, bro, you are going to be moving like a 99 speed guard, bro. This is really ridiculous how fast you are once you get quick first step on Hall of Fame. And I'm going to be showing y'all the right badges, bro. Even with the 88 block with a 611 wingspan, bro, you get snatch blocks, snatch blocks, chase down blocks, inside the paint blocks against like paint bees, bro. It's literally overpowered, bro. I'm going to show y'all the right badges to equip, though. Alright, for the, um, I ain't gonna lie, bro, I'm gonna show y'all the LaMelo Ball takeover, and I'm gonna show you the other takeovers that I would prefer to use, too. So, LaMelo Ball takeover, man, we're gonna do limitless range, and we're gonna do, um, pull-up precision. Pull-up precision helps, like, if you time your fades real good, you'll green them every single time. Now, the other takeovers that I would use, I would use limitless range again, and then I would do, um, finishing moves. Finishing moves help you get contact dunks over and over and over, bro. It's really overpowered. So, hey, if you want to be literally the LaMelo Ball, man, I would definitely put pull-up precision in limitless range. But if you want to be, I guess, the more, I guess you could say, comp takeovers or the takeovers that will win you the game every single time, limitless range and finishing moves. The build name comes out to scoring machine. Hey. The LaMelo Ball build, y'all. I'm telling y'all, bro. This build is over. Yo, why is it not letting me put my overall up, bro? Am I tripping? Yeah, 2K, bro. 2K. Alright, for look, look, look. For finishing badges, man. Rockwood Posterizer. Slithery Finisher. And Heat Seeker. Put Heat Seeker Hall of Fame. That would be 12. And for the last one, man, you would put on Fearless Finisher. I apologize. I don't know why I did not let me upgrade my player. Hopefully 2K fix that soon. But Heat Seeker, Fearless Finisher, it's a great badge, bro. Highlight Film is for whenever. It's basically Showtime from Current Gen. Helps your teammates get their takeover after dunks. But Heat Seeker is the same exact as Highlight Film just for yourself. Helps it boost your takeover. So you'll get your takeover really fast. Shooting, we're going to rock with Deep Threes. I'll, um, Hall of Fame Hot Zone. Hot shot. Now this badge right here, bro. Hot shot. You take two threes, bro. Two threes. You have your takeover already. You take three threes. You're about to get your second takeover, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Hot shot is the most overpowered badge in the game right now, bro. I'm telling y'all now. Three shots, you got both your takeovers, bro. It's that overpowered. Make sure y'all rock with that, bro. Blinders, stop and pop. And for the last two, man, we can't even put it on because it ain't thing. Now let us upgrade, bro. That's crazy. Can't even put it on. But um, for right now, man, just blinders and stop and pop. I would say difficult shots because if you could time your fades, bro, I'm telling y'all now, bro, you can green them over and over and over, bro. They're overpowered. Fades are overpowered if you put difficult shots on and know your jump shot. I Listen. I be fading like crazy. If y'all follow my Twitch, y'all see me fading like crazy, bro. It's overpowered. Playmaking, man, we're gonna rock with. Hey, we can't even put this up because the damn, damn game don't wanna freaking. Oh, lordy, bro. Lordy, lordy, lordy. So we put four here on Unpluckable, four on Handles for Days, Stop and Go, Bullet Passer, that works good on um, Silver, Bell Out on Silver, Ankle Breaker on Gold. I'll just tell y'all my setup, bro. Silver Unpluckable, Hall of Fame Handles for Days. Quick first step, Hall of Fame. 
Silver Bullet Passer, Silver Bell Out, and Ankle Breaker, bro. And Dimer on Gold. Them are the badges I rock with. So, yeah, make sure y'all rock with them badges, bro. I apologize for the inconvenience about the thing not letting me upgrade my player, but hey, gotta do what we gotta do. Clamps, Hall of Fame, Intimidator, I don't know, like, yeah, I can't even put that. Rebound Chaser. This is what I, this is what I use. I use Clamps, Gold, Intimidator, Rebound Chaser, Chase Down Artist on Bronze, Hall of Fame Rim Protector, Ankle Braces, and yeah, that's about it, bro. I think I got Clamps, Gold Intimidator, Rebound Chaser, Bronze Chase Down, Hall of Fame Rim Protector, Clutch Defender on uh, Bronze, and Ankle Braces. Because, you know, Pick Dodger really does not need it this year because everybody isos in this game. So, there's really no need for it. But, if y'all enjoyed the video today, man, make sure y'all drop a like down below in the comment section. And, uh, man, hey, tell me what, tell me what um, affiliation y'all boys went with, man. I went with the Beast of the East. Let me know what y'all went to, man. And uh, how y'all liking Next Gen so far, bro. But, look, um, what was I about to say? I thought I was about to say something. No, I'm not about to say but look, um, it's been your boy Duffy, man. If I see y'all boys in my next video tomorrow morning, or if I see y'all boys in my stream tomorrow night, I'm going to see y'all boys when I see y'all, and I'm out.